going everybody? It's your boy Galloman20 and we are back with a tutorial on how to install custom vehicle skins in Into the Flames. So first off, you're going to locate your Into the Flames directory. I'm so used to saying GTA 5 directory. But you're going to do your Into the Flames directory, which will be under your Steam, Steam Apps, Common, and then Into the Flames folder. After that, you're going to see four things pop up. You're going to go to Into the Flames. And you're going to see two folders, binaries and content. From there, you're going to right click in the white space, go down to new. You're going to create a folder and you're going to type in mods, mods with a capital M. From there, you're going to go into that folder and you're going to right click again. And you're going to create another folder and you're going to name it skins with a capital S. And then for today's tutorial purposes, we are going to utilize the ambulance. So we're going to right click again. We're going to click on new and folder and then type in ambulance. Boom. Now you got all your folders created. Now all you got to do is make your vehicle skin. I already got one made up. So let me go ahead and grab that for you. And we're going to drag and drop it in there. So I had the Green Township skin that I utilized in GTA 5. I basically copied and pasted it over the template that was given to me and I was able to convert it basically to Into the Flames. So anytime you add a vehicle to the game, so let's just say you want to do Engine 1. You're going to right click, create a new folder, name it Engine 1, and then put that skin into that folder. Uh, you would call it Engine 1 underscore skin. This one is Ambulance, so we're going to do Ambulance underscore skin. Always has to be a PNG file, always has to be the name of the vehicle that you were adding into the game uh, previously. So like I said, we're adding an Ambulance, we have an Ambulance folder, then we're going to add the Ambulance underscore skin as a PNG file, and then we're done from there. Um, so we're going to go back to the mods folder and we're going to go to the top and just right click on it. You're going to click copy address as text. Then we're going to minimize or you can leave it up, whatever you feel. We're going to go to into the flames, open up the game. And then once it's loaded up, you're going to go to mod directory right here. You're going to see this. It's going to say mod directory location and it's going to say update directory. Well, you're going to click on this. It's going to flash. That means you know you're doing it correctly. You're going to click Control V on your keyboard. It's going to paste that text that you just copied in there. Click Update Directory, and now you're good to go. TryHard already has a server for us, so we're going to go ahead and join his server. Okay, here we are at Station 3. We're going to go to Station 6 right here. Click on Ambulance. <laughs> Ambulance is already up and running because this is the second time I've redone the tutorial. So that's why it's here and that's why it's on. So we're going to click I. I is going to bring up this vehicle customization. And all we're going to do is we're going to click on load custom skin. What that does is it brings up the custom skin that we just applied to the game. So here's Green Township fired an EMS. I mean, perfect. We're going to turn the lights on. Everything is perfect. Backside, not so much. We got to redo that a little bit, make a clean cut. But right now, for tutorial purposes, it's good. So this is a tutorial on how to add custom vehicle skins into Into the Flames. Hope you guys have a great rest of your day, and I will see you in the next one. I'm out of here. Peace. If you want to get to Alice, I would drive yourself there. That's what I'm doing. You just had to figure out where it was at first. Ooh, you have a... Big large structure fire over here. I mean, that's like you would need a ladder for that shit. <laughs> like a big ladder. Where? In the city? Yeah. That's where I'm coming from. It's by six. Oh, so. Well, yeah, yeah, I'm not worried about that one. What the fuck does Jack want? God damn it. Does the quilt place a number on the truck? Would you like? I don't fucking know. Look for yourself, you fucking lazy bastard.
I think he got the hint after getting kicked twice before he even gets in the server. <laughs> Have you seen it?